Hi friends, welcome to Lovely's Kitchen. In today's recipe, I'm going to show you how to make my mom style chicken curry. So let's see how it's made. So for this recipe, I'm taking 3 fourths a cup of mustard oil. If you have mustard oil, please use mustard oil because it makes a huge difference. But if you don't have, you can use any other vegetable oil too. So I added 1 tablespoon of cumin seeds which is also called as jeera in India and when it gets crackling add a few whole red chilies I'm gonna fry these babies for a little while about 30 seconds and then I'll be adding four to five bay leaves I'm gonna fry them for 30 seconds and then we will be adding chopped onions so for this recipe I have taken four large chopped onion and we will be frying the onions for about 10 minutes because it takes time to fry them till it becomes golden color to fry the onions a little bit faster, I'm going to be adding some salt. But remember that you have added salt, so we have to equalize the level of salt at the end. This is how it looks after 5 minutes of frying it. So frying onions is not easy, it takes time. It's about 8 minutes and you can see that the onions have changed color. It's dark brown in color. At this point we will be adding chicken. I'm taking about around 2 pounds of chicken with bones. So it is around a kilo chicken. And we are going to fry this on high heat for 2 minutes. have mixed up everything and now I'm going to cover it and cook it for two minutes after two minutes it looks like this you can see the oil has come up and water has evaporated so it should look like this before you add your masala to it so here I have taken two tablespoons of ginger garlic paste 1 teaspoon of red chili, 1 teaspoon of cumin powder, 1 teaspoon of haldi or turmeric and 1 teaspoon of coriander powder. To that I'm adding water. Mix them well and this will be added to the chicken which we already fried. We're going to be adding little water to it. mix them really well and then we will be covering it and cooking it for 15 minutes on low heat this is one of my favorite chicken curry recipes which I'm sharing with you all because this belongs to my mom and it brings out so much childhood memory to me when I make it each and every time in some salt but remember that in the beginning I have also added salt to the onions while it was frying so make sure that you remember mix them really well and we're gonna cover it and cook it for 10 minutes on medium to slow heat Let's check the chicken curry. Mm, it's looking really yummy. So you can see that oil has come up. That means the chicken is halfway done. Masala is cooked. And now I'm going to be adding 
one large chopped tomato. Mix it really well and then we will be covering it and cooking it for another 5 minutes on same low heat. freshly made garam masala so here I have taken uh, some cardamom cinnamon clove which I have crushed and this powder is going to get added to the chicken curry which I make you can actually smell the chicken curry when you add the freshly ground uh, garam masala if you have uh, powdered garam masala you can add that too but I think freshly ground garam masala makes a difference I added half a cup of warm water so you can add water according to your thinness of the gravy but I like my gravy to be thick last but not the least we added some chopped cilantro here our chicken curry is ready it looks absolutely amazing and the taste is unbelievable it can be served with plain rice fried rice naan roti bread Hopefully you guys have enjoyed my video tutorial. Thank you for watching it. To get more of my latest videos, please subscribe.